Today I will show you how you can turn a 2D vector artwork into 3D in Cinema 4D. Starting in Adobe Illustrator, I prepared this fox. Just make sure that all your splines are closed paths, and it is easier if everything like the head for example is on a separate layer. First you're gonna save your work, go to File, Save As, and here you can choose which version you want. To make this work, select the Illustrator 8 version. Now you can switch to Cinema. This little cutout scene was entirely made with this technique. But if you don't have Illustrator, it's ok. You can create your splines directly in Cinema 2. Now go to File, Merge Objects and import your Illustrator file which you saved earlier. Now you have all your splines right here. The paths of the head for example are all in one group. So take this whole group, right click, connect objects plus delete. Select all your splines while holding down the alt key and click on extrude. Change the offset and position of the objects till you're happy. Let's move on to the material. Create a U-Render material and change the diffuse color and enable subsurface. I start with the translucency first and change the values depending on how much light I want to reach the front. After that I turn on the surface scattering to smooth everything out. If you would like to know more about subsurface scattering, make sure to check out our overview tutorial video. Link is in the description below. Thanks for watching.